came from Trinidad in the West Indies. And um, I miss the islands. However, Canada has been good to me. And I knew the Salvation Army from ever since in Trinidad. However, I never thought at one point that I would need the Salvation Army the way I asked for help. Happily married and everything, had everything in the world. My house, my two kids, my boy, my girl. No problem, you know. I used to drink. However, I never thought it was going to affect my marriage. And uh, what happened is that at one point I had an accident. After the accident, I just couldn't um, work no more. I had to go to the union and everything, but then it, it didn't work out. And my wife decided, you know what? She just threw these papers onto me and said, look at them separating you because uh, we can't um, maintain this house. So I said, okay, fine. And I had nowhere to go. I never thought I was an alcoholic, I never thought. So I thought I just drank to forget the problems. And I went to the Salvation Army. I was still drinking, of course, but they helped me, they didn't judge me. Addictions and shelter. I use addictions and the shelter because when I was doing the addiction because of alcohol, I had no place to live, so I had to use shelter. And they, the Bayside Mission was the one who took me in and gave me a room. It's a six month program. The first month was like, I just wanted to get out of there. Nobody would understand what you feel when you're a drunk, living on the streets, and there's nowhere to turn except for the Salvation Army where you could get a little bit of food to eat and where people respect you. I felt that the Salvation Army really did help me quite a lot in my um, struggles and uh, I am better now. Well, you see right now, I've been clean. I've been uh, teaching since um, August of last year and I'm working on my PhD right now. My future is looking great. I got my kids, I got my life back. And I'm looking forward to doing my research because every day I got something to look forward to. And every day when I wake up, I thank God that the Salvation Army did help me out to put me where I am today.